Mm. Smells so good. I've been talking about my favorite tools on the show for a while now, but a few of you have asked me what my top tools are to get me through the day, uh, actual tool or otherwise. Well, let me give you one hint right here. Mm. One of my favorite mugs is this Tool Time mug, an original mug from the Home Improvement TV show days. I've actually built up a small collection of them throughout the years, and my favorite thing to pour into it is the breakfast blend from Maxwell House Coffee. By the way, thanks for sponsoring this episode, guys. Now, just like how your car needs to warm up in the morning, get the juices flowing before it can perform its best, well, we humans need that too, or at least some of us do. I certainly do. I'm a coffee-holic, and I'm a zombie until I get my morning coffee. That's the problem with working so hard and burning midnight oil and then getting up early to do it again, is I need something to help me out when it's go time. So here's the problem. I'm a pretty busy guy. Like most of the things I do on a daily basis, even when it comes to my coffee, I need a convenient, no-nonsense, dependable, and easy solution. I need my morning coffee. It's part of my morning ritual every single morning. It just has to happen. But I really don't have time for it. With Maxwell House K-Cup coffee pods, I can just grab a pod and do my frictionless coffee routine. I always know what I'm getting every single time. I just fill up my favorite mug with water, pour it into the coffee maker's tank, pop in some fuel, and a couple minutes later, BAM! I have the same consistent, great tasting cup of coffee that I need day in and day out. Plus, there's no waste from brewing an entire pot of coffee only to decide that you've had enough or something comes up and you gotta leave the house. That's just money down the drain. With Maxwell House's K-Cup coffee pods, it's on demand. You want another cup? Well, you make another cup. You're not wasting all that coffee and water, which if you're like me and you live in California, you know how expensive water is. For the summer, I pour in some ice to make iced coffee, and for those cold mornings or the winter, I keep it hot. But either way, I'm saving a ton of cash from having to go to a coffee shop, so when I hit the road, I just make sure I have my Maxwell House coffee to go when I leave, saving me time and money. Another way I save time is ordering online at Amazon. In just a few clicks, it's delivered right to my door a day or two later. This frees up more time to spend with my family and friends. Whether it's during breakfast, reading my morning news, or throughout the day when I need that extra nudge, it's so easy to just go grab another mug of my breakfast blend and keep on trucking. I don't know what I'd do without it. My next top tool to get me through the day is this roll of clear sticky tape. Now, I know what you're thinking already. Tape, Chris? Seriously? That's how you get through your day? Well, the days that I do use it make up for the days that I don't. So, no, I don't use it every single day, but this has been a lifesaver. It's something I discovered recently, and I want to tell you all about it because you need to know about this, too. It's called Nano Tape. It comes in various lengths, and you can pick one up for about 10 bucks. It's a gel-like, double-sided, transparent tape that's reusable. Here are a couple of examples. I had a very stubborn power strip in the studio that I just couldn't get to stay up using traditional double-sided tape or screws in the wall. I removed all of that and put up a single strip of nano tape behind it and it hasn't budged since. We've got a small doormat by our front door. It's always moving around, especially thanks to the dogs that keep playing around by the front door. And I got tired of repositioning it every day. A couple strips of this nano tape keep it from moving around. It even works for area rugs that are on top of carpet. And we've got a kitchen table that has a small cover on one of the legs to hide the hardware. It kept on falling off. I put a few small pieces of clear magic on it and it's good to go. Have you got a chair or sofa that keeps sliding around on your hardwood floors? Well, cut off a few squares, put it under the legs or the feet in this case, and it won't move around anymore. It's an awesome furniture stopper. Working on your car and tired of tools sliding around? Just grab a piece of this tape and stick it anywhere and your tools won't move around. Need to hang something on your wall but don't want to mess with nails or screws? Just grab a piece of nano tape and it'll stay put. Great for decorations, pictures, or anything else. How about a simple tool organizer? Lay a strip down anywhere and stick anything to it. In your car and need a way to keep things from sliding around? Nano tape. I found out that it really works well on porous surfaces like stucco walls. Check this out, that's an actual 20 ounce hammer just hanging out on a stucco wall. Now there is a weight limitation to this tape, I did exceed it with this hammer. It stayed up for a couple hours though, so just be cautious of that. As you can tell, there are a million uses to use this sticky stuff in your home, your shop, your car, or basically anywhere. And every day I keep finding new ways to use it that I hadn't thought of before, solving problems that I just couldn't solve before. Now what's great about this is that unlike 3M automotive tape, which I've used quite a bit in the past, this is reusable and washable. 
just stick it underneath the faucet in some water and rinse it off and dry it off or just let it dry on its own and you can use it all over again. Nanotape is truly magical and amazing stuff. If you've never heard of this before, I highly recommend that you go pick up a roll. It's not very expensive and you, like me, will find needs for it all the time because things move around and things need to be stuck in certain places and sometimes a screw just is a little bit too much. So you peel off a little bit of this tape, stick it on and you're good to go and you just sit back and go, wow. That stuff's pretty awesome and it works on just about every surface as long as it's not greasy or it's flaking off. So go pick up a roll. You'll thank me later. Now my final top tool to help me get through the day is literally something that I use every single day multiple times per day and I've always got it with me. Now for years I've had a pocket knife, but what do I end up using it for? Well, mostly just opening up boxes and breaking them down. The problem there is that this nice sharp blade gets dull really fast and it gets all gummed up from the glue from the tape. So I'm constantly cleaning it and sharpening it. No fun. So I got smart, right? Got a utility knife. Then I can open up boxes, I can change out the blade, twist it around, throw it out, get a new one, no big deal. Well, that kind of defeated the purpose of having a pocket knife with me all the time. I finally realized that what I needed to carry around with me all the time was just a utility knife. But everything that I found to hold a simple utility knife blade was too big and bulky. They worked great, but the size was the problem. I started looking for a minimalist utility knife blade holder, and by that I mean something that's just slightly larger than the utility knife blade itself, but also had a belt clip so I could put it here in my pocket where I normally keep my pocket knife and was usable. And by that I mean something that is still big enough to grab so I don't have to worry about sliding out of my hand or cutting myself so I can slice and dice all those boxes. But it also needed to have a blade that was easy to deploy and easy to replace without having to use a tool. So here's what I found. It's called the TPT Slide. It's a titanium pocket tool that comes in matte black and stonewashed silver. I went with the black. It came with a 550 paracord lanyard, but I removed mine to keep it even more minimal. Not only does it hold standard utility knife blades, but it also has a few other features. It has the one-handed operation, so it's easy to deploy the blade. It's got a belt clip, which is removable, by the way, so you can keep it clipped in your pocket like you would a standard pocket knife. It's also got a built-in bottle opener, which I use all the time, and it even works without removing the blade. So cool. It's got a mini pry bar, which also can act as a flathead screwdriver. This is great for opening paint cans, too. Removing the blade takes a little bit of work. I hold it like this and twist it, then the blade comes out. You can flip it around or replace it. This takes a little bit getting used to, but once you figured it out, it's not a problem. Speaking of which, when the blade is out, its opening acts as a universal SAE and metric wrench, accommodating fasteners up to 12 millimeters or 7 16 of an inch. Now this didn't work out well at all for me during testing. In fact, I couldn't get it to work once. It's even got a hex opening to hold your hex bit drivers so you can use your screwdriver bits or your sockets. It's pretty cool. Now this little guy's a little pricey when you compare it to EDC pocket knives, but it's worth it. It's super lightweight. It's made from titanium and there's just no way that you can break this. Believe me, I've tried. It will not bend or break. It's easy to deploy. It's got other features like the bottle opener that I use all the time. And it's just got a great design, great engineering behind it. And from my research, there's nothing else out there on the market that comes close to this little guy. Nothing at all. And these are my three top tools to get me through the day every single day. Of course, I need my tasty coffee to start the day. I need my magic sticky tape to stick stuff to other stuff. And I need my minimalist pocket tool to open up the boxes when more coffee and more sticky tape arrives. Anyway, I've got links in the description for you to check them all out yourself. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.